Hi, welcome to Simply Scuba. In this session, we're going to look at the Aqualung Pearl I3 BCD. It's a lady specific BCD, um, and we'll take a look from the top down. It is a top of the line BCD, so it has pretty much every feature uh, you could ask for and a few more. Starting at the neck, then, it has a soft collar that goes all the way round, that stops the BCD uh, rubbing against you for ultimate comfort. As we come down, You've got a pull dump on the shoulder. You've got quick release buckles. That comes down into uh, detail uh, embroidery on this kind of cross your heart style system. Now, whether you're a fan of this particular design or not, the ladies that use this all rave about it. And a lot of people that we've spoken to who do use the jacket have said that initially they had some concerns about this because it's a very feminine looking uh, front to a BCD but once they've used it the comfort of the jacket makes it absolutely their BCD of preference so carry on down a little bit you've got integrated weight system you just pull the handle and it slips out easy to put the weights in it's just a velcro system put your weights back in goes back in it's a very positive click you definitely know it's in position the great thing about this BCD is being a ladies BCD, it's cut much shorter. The length of the jacket is shorter than a men's BCD. That means for ladies, it stops the BCD digging into the hips, which is a very common complaint, in that the jacket now stops a little bit higher up on the body. You've got pockets, which are of a good size, mesh lined, with a little D-ring inside there so you can snap on a torch or a slate inside your pocket and zip it away that's a bellowed pocket highly resistant uh, kind of a plasticized finish on the side of the BCD across the front there's a small pocket in the front of the cummerbund again with a little uh, strap so you can clip things in there if you need to just for general purpose stuff anything that you need regularly uh, during the dive can go in there Good positive clip. Obviously, being a ladies jacket, there's no chest strap, but with this cross your heart system, there's actually no need for a chest strap anyhow. If we move around to the opposite side of the BCD, you will see here two grommets. That fits uh, knives like the Aqualung squeeze knife. Um, just locates through there and then uh, obviously can be used as you need it during the dive. Steel D-ring uh, on the sides. Again, on a top of the range jacket, you'd expect that sort of feature. The opposite weight pocket, you've got another steel D-ring down here. You've also got a spare pocket down here, which rolls down. It's actually secured by Velcro. You just give it a pull and it folds down. It's an additional one, so you'd only deploy it if you needed to. Uh, it's mesh on the back, so it's very easy draining. A really nice little pocket again, with a D-ring inside it, really well thought out. And when not in use, that just rolls back up and Velcros in underneath. This is the i3 version of this jacket. It does come as a standard version and the i3. i3 is just inflate, deflate, your hands naturally are around this area when you're diving. So it's very intuitive once you've got used to the location of this to use this sort of inflator deflator. As a backup to the inflator system, you do have an oral inflate system on the pocket here at the top. You just pull it out and this cord comes out and you can just blow into it. Or in an emergency to deflate, you just push that back and hold it up as you would with a traditional one. To put this away, it's very rarely needed, if ever. It just pushes back into the pocket, so it's hardly visible. Strap back across, like that. So that's the front of the jacket. Let's now spin the jacket around and have a look at the rear. More great features on the rear of the jacket. You've got Aqualung's flat profile valves. Good carry handle really nicely padded rubberized handle very comfortable what you can't see is on the inside of the jacket 
there's a big gel pad that covers the whole of the back area and that again makes it very comfortable for ladies. You've got a tank traction pad. Now, it's a little bit tricky to see, but the traction pad, if you imagine this is your spine, the traction pad is angled out slightly. This is to avoid the very common problem that ladies complain of, of the cylinder resting on the top of their backsides uh, and becoming uncomfortable after several dives. So by having the tank just flared away ever so slightly, it means the tank's away and you get that increased comfort. You also have on the cam band counterweight pockets, again for trimming your weight, and they've backed it up with 25 millimeter Fastex clips. Another pressure release valve or dump valve on that side as well. All in all, with ladies' BCDs, the Pearl standard version and this version, the i3, are by far the top selling jackets. Very rarely does a lady who's tried one of these on not purchase it. The only reason possibly not to purchase it may be that it's outside of your price point. But if you can afford it, this is probably the ladies' jacket for you.